Moving on to Bengaluru now. Another shocker from this city, an event manager has been arrested for allegedly drugging, sexually assaulting and then blackmailing a minor from Mumbai who was working with him. The accused, Pradesh Kapoor, is currently in custody and POKSO, Protection of Children from Sexual Offences Act, has been invoked in this case. Shija sent us these details. Yet another rape shocker has come to light here in Bengaluru. What we know is that a 17-year-old college-going girl, minor girl, was drugged and raped. And this incident was reported on Sunday, only on Sunday, when the girl, in fact, uh, what we know, she's a college-going girl as well as was doing a modeling assignment uh, by, the si by her side. Also, she was contacted by this particular accused, uh, Pragdij uh, Kapoor, who, in fact, contacted her and asked her to visit to uh, her, his residents who in fact for, promised her of a job in modeling industry. What we also know is that uh, when this uh, victim reached his residence, he immediately offered her, her a drink spiked with sedatives, drugged her and raped her. In fact, uh, the, uh, the victim in fact uh, mustered courage and reported this entire incident to the city police commissioner who in turn filed a complaint, registered a complaint under the POXO Act and they immediately in fact uh, uh, arrested the accused Pragdi Kapoor also what we understand during the investigation it was revealed that this was not a very first case that Pradesh uh, Kapoor had committed in fact various other people were also involved in this and various other victims also he had approached quite a few models who, who in fact he promised and the police are in fact uh, investigating this angle as well in Bengaluru Shrija for Magic Breaks now this is a minor and in the minors case Nobody should be looking at it as if there would have been provocation, as if there could be any kind of consent, as if this lady, this girl is the one to be taking primary responsibility. Because that seems to be the kind of mindset by the system in general, whether it is the police, the prosecutor or the magistrate. And that is what we need to challenge. Because there is a law now, may not be a great law, but whatever this law is, you follow the law to the T and not find technicalities to see to uh, get this man outside on bail there's no way you give him bail because he is a threat to the child now if he comes out on bail he's a threat to the child just like how other rapists are threats to the victim survivors and i do hope that the magistrate will look at it very very seriously and the police will give all the necessary protection to this child they should be careful going out late at night and probably they should, you know, uh, inform their parents or their family members uh, where they are going so that, you know, like they can be traced easily if, in case they are in trouble. The parents should be aware of it and uh, like, you know, should avoid the late nights, oh. especially the pubs and all, all that. Uh, you should put your wall where you should know. You should put your limits. So they'll also know they won't take advantage. The people are there, both the site is there. Some they have to come to that level, they'll go ahead. They are, you can't force them. I know Pragdish Roy Kapoor, he told us he's a casting director and he approached me as well. Uh, but then uh, I found him a little shady, so I just, you know, kept my distance. But then she's a 17 year old and I, uh, she's obviously not as mature in understanding what he is like you can't blame the girl actually because she didn't like she didn't know that she would ever go through so much right because of one option i mean she would have trusted him and gone and it's not only a fashion it's anybody maybe she required money that time maybe she was going through a position where you know she couldn't explain uh, anything to anyone so you know she said okay if i'm getting money i'll do it i think government has to take strict actions against it because uh, once the government doesn't take any step i don't think any action would be taken okay like okay. And every time uh, People coming on the streets won't help. The person should obviously be uh, pro prosecuted by the police and should not be left by bail. I think there should be strict term, I mean, for at least for five years or six year jail. You can watch live TV on our website, mbnow.in. Find us on Facebook at facebook.com forward slash magic bricks now. And don't forget to click the like button. You can also follow us on Twitter at magic bricks now. To stay updated with all our programming, hit the subscribe button on our YouTube channel by logging on to youtube.com forward slash magicbricksnow.